Right from the moment you power up the BF F8 HP Pro, it sets itself apart from the older BF F8 HP in several ways. For starters, the newer Pro version covers three bands, 70 centimeter, 1.25 meter, and 2 meter, whereas its predecessor was limited to just 2 meters and 70 centimeters. This extra coverage on 1.25 meter alone makes a big difference if you need more flexibility, especially for local repeaters in the 220 megahertz range. Another notable change is the built-in GPS receiver, which replaces the traditional flashlight found on the older BF F8 HP. Although some operators might miss having a light, the new GPS feature allows location sharing with preset contacts, making it especially handy for group outings or search and rescue work. Performance is where this Pro version truly outdoes the classic BF F8 HP. Baofeng advertises 8 watts on 70 centimeter and 2 meter, and 5 watts on 1.25 meter. But power tests on both sources showed the BF F8 HP Pro can exceed those numbers. On 2 meter, it pushed around 11 watts, and on 70 centimeter, it hit around 9 watts, both higher than what the older BF F8 HP managed in typical real world usage. Add to that about 5.5 to 5.7 watts on 1.25 meter, and you've got a radio that delivers more punch in similar handheld form factor. In terms of build quality, you'll notice the sturdier housing and better battery locking compared to the older version. The Pro also ships with a 2500 mAh battery that charges via USB-C, a convenient leap forward from the older micro USB, or charging cradle methods. Additionally, you get IP54 splash and dust protection, something the previous BF F8 HP didn't widely advertise. This extra ruggedness, well, not waterproof, is more than adequate for handling typical outdoor scenarios. Another reason why this is one of the best Baofeng offerings is the improved programming and usability features. You can store up to a thousand channels, and Baofeng introduced zones, so you can group repeaters or channels together for faster navigation. While the original BF F8 HP had the standard Baofeng menu, it lacked these advanced grouping and zone options. The Pro also has what Baofeng calls firmware update capability, suggesting they can patch bugs or add features over time. That's a significant advantage over the older models, which typically stay locked to their factory firmware. Now, the Pro isn't flawless. One issue is its harmonic output on the 2-meter band, reported to be only about 18.9 decibels below the main signal. That's a bit higher than ideal and could be a concern for stricter emission standards. Even so, many users will find it a worthy trade-off given its tri-band coverage, bigger battery capacity, and feature-rich design. You still get standard Baofeng quirks, like average performing stock antennas, so investing in an aftermarket whip might help if you want to maximize range and clarity. Considering everything, the BF F8 HP Pro pulls ahead with real upgrades, tri-band capability, GPS, stronger casing, and higher tested wattage. If you're looking for a well-rounded analog model that offers more than the usual two-band choices, this is currently Baofeng's most exciting option. It improves upon the older BF F8 HP on nearly all fronts, which is why I consider it the best Baofeng analog ham radio. To sum up what I like is the tri-band coverage, 2 meter, 70 centimeter, 1.25 meter, the higher than advertised wattage, the GPS location sharing, the larger 2500 milliamp hour battery with USB-C charging, and the zones feature and firmware update support. On the downside, harmonic on 2 meter could be better, the stock antenna remain mediocre, there is no built-in flashlight, and switching zones requires extra menu steps. Thanks for watching. Hopefully this helped you figure out which is the best radio for you. Remember, you can check prices in the description below. And if you're interested in more radio reviews and suggestions, be sure to check out more of our videos. Before you go, please don't forget to like this video, subscribe to stay updated, and let me know your opinion and suggestions in the comments. Have an awesome day.